So what I'm going to be talking about in this video is something that's been happening to me, um, I'd say for the past year, um, and it's also something that you may all experience as well, uh, maybe in a different fashion or in a different environment, but the best way to describe what I'm going to be talking about is being in the moment or being the moment and just exactly how that comes across to me what it's like and I I guess the uh, the confusing trickery almost paradox of a situation that occurs um, when we try to willingly enter this, the moment, and be in the moment. So let me just first describe how it began, how it began with me. Um, for, for the past three years of my life, I've been doing uh, tons of on and off work with psychedelics and Eastern mysticism. And... <clears throat> Throughout the whole the whole uh, span, I've had many uh, very bizarre states of consciousness and uh, found myself in some pretty peculiar uh, places in terms of perception, um, thought streams, uh, belief, you know, stuff like that. And this thing that I'm going to be talking about, this being in the moment. Um, at first, at first, it was so alien to me, so foreign to me to be in the moment that, first of all, I wasn't even trying to do, to do it. And second of all, when it would happen to me, I didn't know what was happening. I thought some, like, I thought I was freaking out or something, like... I thought something was wrong or like I'm I'm having like a panic attack or like I'm um, reading way too hard into the situation I'm in because like I said it this this <clears throat> merging with the moment thing it would happen to me randomly and the way the best way I can describe it is I'd be at work mostly it would be at work or I'd be at home playing video games or something and all of a sudden everything just seems to like broaden <clears throat> in every sense like like just metaphorically it seems like everything in your vision is what it is and very clear <clears throat> um, and everything in your mind um, when it when it would happen to me randomly everything would just sort of like malfunction and it's almost like I couldn't like like there's this story that's going on in your head day to day describing your narrating your life and your experience like a little internal diary or movie you know that you're that you're getting the context out of. But when I would randomly merge into the moment, what I call it, it would feel like this dialogue just stops and everything is just dancing around in front of me and people are communicating and leaves are blowing in the wind and I am basically gone and it's this feeling of what is happening is all that is happening to me everything that is available to happen to me is happening you know I, and it, it's it's like you it's like you forget about it's like I it's like I forget about my body in my mind, in the outsideness of everything, 
and it all merges together into an experience, one experience going on, one dance, one flowing, rhythmic, changing vibration, you know, to be poetic. And like I said, this would happen to me randomly. And I wouldn't know how to identify it. It would scare me. I would make jokes about it like it would make me dizzy when it would happen. Like, out of nowhere, I'd just feel like everything is just happening. Like, everything is just happening regardless of what I'm doing or if I'm trying to make it happen, you know, and these people are all around me and they look the way they do without trying and, and, and all, the, all the things in my environment are being what they are without trying and everything in my head is just happening the way it is and it's like there's not a place that I am anymore. It's almost like you go from feeling like you're thinking and choosing and making decisions and making, you know, opinions and judgments and then it's all of a sudden like you're seeing that along with your whole, the whole rest of your universe, your available universe. And it destroys the boundaries in between them where you, they, they, you literally can't see them in that period of time, you know. And now that I've kind of described this merging into the moment thing I'm talking about, which is the only way I can really describe it, you know. It might just be a fucking weird state of consciousness that some psychologist can explain to me on page 3, article 2, you know. But the way I describe it is merging with the moment because <clears throat> everything basically becomes one and merges and dissolves. You dissolve the the dialogues dissolve the the separations dissolve which all, all that stuff is in your dialogue basically and when that dialogue just like malfunctions like i said <clears throat> you're just left raw happening like 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 an explosion in space that's you know still happening but like I said, now that I've described to you this merging in the moment thing uh, that I've been talking about, this used to happen to me randomly, <clears throat> and it still does, it still does. But the second half of what I want to talk about is what happens when I willingly try to get into that state, you know? So, just just to say right off, I can willingly get into that state. It's entirely possible to get into that state at my own will. But it requires tactic. That's funny because that says tactic right there. It requires tactics. Very, very precise ways of observing. And this is where I want to talk about the paradox of the merging with the moment or being in the moment type thing. So this just happened to me last night. This just happened last night. I'm sitting here, right here in this stool, and I'm listening to a Ram Dass lecture, and I just decide to close my eyes and be with what is. Not even thinking about this, this state that I'm talking about right now, but I just decided to be with what's happening and all of a sudden just like that it merged into that state it 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 formed into that formless state of merging with the moment and immediately i felt my conscious dialogue just come pouring back in going Oh my god, that was just that feeling that you randomly get, you know? That was just that feeling of everything being one that you can find yourself in randomly. And 
I am, I'm, I'm, and then there's another part of my mind that's going, shut up, shut up. You know you're what's distracting you from the moment. Can you, can you see what I'm saying there? And it's, it's like, as I'm able to be with the moment, my mind, my dialogue, which is indeed the moment, begins to speak going, don't focus on me. Don't focus on what my your mind is saying. I, but it's part. It's part of the moment. It's part of the moment, you know. And that's the trickery I found myself in last night. Was um, at one point being in the moment, and there's just silence, nothingness. It all is. And then hearing my mind going. You're in the moment right now. This is the moment. Don't get distracted by your thoughts, you know? And it's so easy to think that's you accidentally thinking. That you go, oh, stop, stop, stop thinking. Just be with the moment. But that right there is more of the moment. That right there is more of the moment. And when you just let your mind, ah, da 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 da, da just fucking say what it wants and and think there are the layers of itself that there are like oh don't listen to this part of your mind even though I'm your mind you know like it's sloppy your mind is sloppy and when you look at it when you don't talk in your head because you're not the one talking in your head it's spontaneous arising thoughts when you just watch that not guide it, not not try to um, change its content or think that it's the wrong stuff in your mind or the right stuff in your mind, you know, because even thinking, oh, I'm so in the moment right now, <clears throat> I'm in such a meditative space, that is, you know, you... You're, you are tied to that. You think you're saying that and you're going, ah, you know, it's coming out of you. But, you know, it's just right here. It's right here in front of you. And if you just watch it willingly, not speak, not change what it's saying, not attach to it as you, I think you'll be in the moment because... This is what I've kind of realized. I, I tried doing it at work today. And it was like it was going. Ooh, ooh. Like I'm in the moment. Oh, I'm being fucking delusional. Oh, I'm back in the moment. Oh, my mind's going crazy again. You know, and it was like I was like on the on the cusp of just everything is just happening. You know, and then I would be distracted by the orders I was being given at work or somebody talking to me or my mind just wandering off into some other like realm of thought you know just forgetting about the whole moment thing and being with them and just oh I wonder I wonder how my cat's doing at home right now ah I really should have cleaned my room earlier today or Oh, I don't want to be at work right now. I'd rather be home playing video games. Man, I want a sip of coffee. You know, I could go on and on and on about the different directions that my mind will go in um, when I just watch it. When I just watch it. And before I know it, and this is why I'm practicing, before I know it, I grab onto one and I'm gone. My, my awareness gone and I'm just absorbed into this this route of whatever my mind is thinking and whatever my body is feeling you know and whatever that is is what I identify with at that time but I hope I hope I described well to you uh, and I hope you can relate to what I would define this as which is merging into the moment or being in the moment as we all talk about, you know, but uh, I guess you could say from a, a more uh, East, Eastern philosophy t 
toned moment, you know? Um, but I just really wanted to talk about how it randomly used to happen to me as I'm getting involved with all this spirituality stuff. And just around now in my life, I am beginning to realize you can put yourself there just by being very careful, very conscious. You can, you can silently, without even letting yourself know, be in that, be in it, be in this, you know? No more of the, of the controlling thought streams, you know? But I just thought this was very interesting. Very interesting. Um, just in the, in terms of being able to put myself there. I've never really tried and didn't even, didn't even really consider that I could. So that's it for this video. I feel I've described it pretty well. Uh, I hope you enjoyed and I will be back with more. Thank you for watching.